We're switching it up today and I'm gonna take you through a tutorial on how to set up a VPN so we can get access to all the best altcoins on Binance. You can't do this if you're a US citizen, so stay tuned for this video and let's start getting crazy crypto gains during this awesome bull cycle of cryptocurrency. Stay tuned. Welcome on into my first video filmed in Miami. I just moved out here from Seattle, Washington, which is having a crazy snowstorm blizzard today. And I'm starting a whole new lifestyle out here with my girlfriend in the other room. But guys, this is a video I had to bring to you because as I've done so much Amazon FBA business over the past three and four years, I've built up enough money where I'm still gonna be funding those products and building new ones on the way and being able to focus a lot more out here. But the main thing I'm focusing on now is kind of this crypto market bull run. Now there's a lot of different places you can buy crypto online like Coinbase, there's Uphold, Gemini, there's a lot of exchanges but the best exchange by far is gonna be Binance. They have the lowest fees and they have every type of altcoin you could possibly want. For instance, I can show you right here, just inside of Coinbase, you can take a quick look at the Coin Cartesi, which is up 247% today. Now, lo and behold, at the bottom it says this is not supported on Coinbase, and that's the reason you have to be able to come onto Binance. Now, the problem with Binance is that it doesn't support a lot of US customers. You can't even be on the original Binance website if you're from the United States. This is because of some SEC laws or something like that, but the best way to bypass that, and trust me, I've spent about 50 hours over the past week delving deep inside what are the best coins to get on. I've been following a lot of BitBoy Crypto's channel, which is the fastest growing cryptocurrency channel, and I'm just trying to make some massive gains during this bull run, and I'm gonna stay tuned to when this bull run is going to come to an end so I'm going to be able to sell out and capitalize on all these different profits. But I don't want you guys to fall victim to the same mistakes I've made where I'm literally watching coins just skyrocket 200, 300, 800 percent in one day like Dogecoin did and I don't want you to sit there and watch that without having the right platform to get it. But what I'm going to show you in today's tutorial video is how to set up a VPN which is a virtual private network so you are able to get onto Binance even if you're in the United States. This is 100% legal. I've looked up all the best information about this and went through about 20 different videos of different VPNs and the best one we're going to be looking at today is Surfshark. You can get it for I think $2 a month or something like that so you will have to pay a little bit for it but the amount of money you can make again like we're seeing with these massive gains in this crypto bull run are just gonna blow that out of the water. It's also just great to have a private server and kind of keep your IP address hidden. After we set that VPN up, I'm gonna show us how we can go set up a Binance account and more importantly, fund the Binance account because we're not gonna wanna verify the Binance account, otherwise it's gonna make you show your personal identification, your driver's license, stuff like that. We don't have to do that. And if you wanna fund it, we're just gonna to have to take funds from maybe our Coinbase account, Gemini account, or any other crypto account, and we're gonna transfer that cryptocurrency into our Binance account. We're not gonna fund the account with our actual bank account. We're not gonna do anything like that. Otherwise, they'll know we're from the US and it won't allow us to use Binance. And if you guys like these types of tutorials, please drop a thumbs up. I'm really excited about cryptocurrency. I was following it back in 2017 and then there was a massive bear market, but this next cycle that we're dealing with right now is massive. Bitcoin's almost at $50,000 right now, so I want you guys to take as much advantage as you can right now. So drop a thumbs up if you like these videos. That tells me you want me to make more of these, and let's jump right into the tutorial right now. So this is the final result, getting your Binance account completely set up and funded, and I wanna stress to you that you wanna get your account funded with USDT, this is a stable coin, so it's always gonna be hovering right around $1, give or take a couple tenths of a penny or something like that. But once your account is funded with this, you have immediate access to disperse any of this amount through any token that you possibly want. And you can come in here and say CTSI, and there's Cartesi right there. We can come and say buy, deposit, trade, and none of these other US exchanges are gonna really allow you to buy any of these tokens at any time. And these are the tokens that are literally taking off. 
Even things like Tron has not really taken off yet, but you can buy it here. You can't buy it anywhere else. So let's jump right into step number one. I'm gonna break it down super simple for everybody. The first thing you wanna do is actually set up a new email account. Now, Proton Mail is the account everyone talks about, and I've taken a screenshot when I did set this up for myself. So this is a fully encrypted email account, which is gonna help keep your anonymity up online. Especially when we go into Binance, you're gonna be creating a new account, so you just wanna go ahead and have this fully encrypted email account, which is absolutely free. So just go ahead and check out the link below in the description. I'm gonna have links to everything you need right below in the description. So we'll have Proton Mail there. Just sign up for your free subscription and select the plan. Once that's set up, you're all good. I don't really need to go through how you need to do all this. Um, but then the second thing you wanna do is actually come over to Surfshark. So they're having a massive discount. I'm pretty sure they do these things all the time. Today it's 81% off, so that's really great. We can say buy now. And you see they're having a massive discount. It's $2.50 a month. I went ahead and bought the whole thing here. I think it was $60 for two years, which was totally great. And again, this VPN is gonna be what you need to be able to get into your Binance account from the US. What a VPN is, is it allows you, and I already have it going here in the corner, but it allows you to select a location and act as if your computer is logging in and maybe you're living in Madrid, Spain, or from any other country outside of the US and that's super great and that's what you need to be able to get into Binance and buy these awesome tokens. So there you go, just sign up right here. Again, I'm gonna have that link right down below. They even offer, if you wanna buy it in cryptocurrency, that's great. I just used a credit card to help boost my business points. That was simple there. So go ahead and set up Surfshark, that's all you need. And from there, we're gonna be actually coming right on into Binance. So I just went ahead and logged out and I'm gonna act as if I'm doing this for the first time. It's really pretty simple from here. You're just gonna to wanna to come to Binance after you set up your VPN. Do not ever come to this website and try and log in if you're not actively on your VPN. You never wanna do that. Otherwise, that's gonna be a red flag and say, this person is logging in from a US-based computer and IP address and we're gonna flag their account. Even if that ever happens and you mistakenly log into this account from your US IP address, all they're gonna do is say, we aren't allowing you to trade anymore, but you are allowed to withdraw all your funds out of this. That's what I had on my regular US Binance account. And I think this just happened in on January 21st or something like that. So it wasn't too long ago that this became a new thing. So this video should really be shared with all your friends if you're trying to get them to see the opportunities that are happening in cryptocurrency. Now, this is gonna be all the step-by-step -step info that they need. So after you are logged in and you've chosen your country, again, stick to one country. I'm in Madrid, Spain, so that's the city and the country. Don't keep switching it to different IP addresses. That could also be a different flag there. I'm just gonna remember this is the country I'm logged in as right then and there. So from there, we can press register now. And all you have to do is now put in your new Proton email there, create your own password, and then put my referral ID in this box right here. This is just an example, but below, just click on the link that I have in the description and you're gonna be able to get a 5% discount on any transactions that you make in terms of fees. Binance already has the lowest transaction fees out there across any other platform, Coinbase, Uphold, Gemini, any of these other platforms, but this is gonna give you an additional 5% off. So as long as you click the link below and sign up there, it's gonna give me, I think, some kind of little commission. I'm not sure exactly what it does, but it's also gonna give you a little kickback there. So click on the link there, then put in your email and password, and then just press create account. And it looks like they sent me a little verification code to my email. So there's my Proton Mail. I'm gonna grab that confirmation code, come right here, paste it, and submit that. It says success. And you can even see right here in the Proton Mail, it says that this is my device and IP address coming from Madrid, Spain. That's exactly what I wanted to see. And boom, I'm right in my account right now. So the next step that we're gonna wanna do is, ooh, and we just made another Amazon sale, so that's pretty cool. 
So we're making 50 bucks on one of my products there. And this is what we're doing. We're making all kinds of money in Miami. It's super cool. I do have my whole channel based around Amazon FBA, but I wanted to bring some crypto news because this is something that I'm super passionate and interested in right now. If you wanna check out more information on Amazon FBA, you can totally see that on my channel. And I take my Amazon course, which my dad and 350 other people have taken. I have a student literally doing $22,000 in sales per week. And that's how I'm able to fund this whole mission here on cryptocurrency. But the big thing I wanted to show you is now that you have your account set up, you need to follow these instructions also very carefully. So hopefully you have a Coinbase account or something like that that holds cryptocurrency. Now I have an Uphold account, which is right down there in the corner, it's Uphold, but you're not allowed to actually send cryptocurrency to another wallet address from Uphold. So hopefully you just have Coinbase or Coinbase Pro, any other account that you can actually send to another wallet address your cryptocurrency. So what you need to do is to be able to come right on into Coinbase and grab a token that you can then send over to Binance. So what I did was I used EOS because there's actually no transaction fees with that. They just make money based on some CPU or some other weird type of uh, mining technique where they mine cryptocurrency. But basically EOS is one of the actual recommended coins that you deposit into your account right here on Binance. So they actually show all these trending coins that people use a lot to send into Binance. And you can see EOS is right down here. Now, I didn't want to use Ethereum because the fees on that are really high. Bitcoin also has high fees and it takes a long time to arrive. EOS arrives in less than one minute. You know, Ethereum can take 10 minutes, Bitcoin's like 30 minutes or an hour or something. USDT, this is Tether, the stable coin, but you can't even buy this on Coinbase. So the best one for me was to grab EOS. And what I did was come right into my phone here. I just pressed on EOS. I said trade, I said buy. And then I literally just sent in however much money I wanted to. I could say preview buy. And you'll see if I say preview buy here, there are some fees with that, but it was funny. By the time I bought this and then sent it over, I had already made like $70 in just extra money because EOS is volatile, just like many other cryptocurrencies. And luckily that amount grew in the short amount of time that it took me to buy EOS and then transfer it over to Tether, which is a stable coin, which is where you wanna keep your money. So it's like you have a one for one for every one Tether, it's like $1 on your account. Again, you can't keep regular US dollars on your account from your bank account in Binance, otherwise they'll know you're from the US. So this is the coin you wanna transfer it to. But you can see there's some fees there. I mean, just eat those up, pony up those fees, no big deal. And you can see right down here, uh, I bought $3,000 worth of EOS not too long ago. There was a little Coinbase fee there. Um, so after you have your EOS in Coinbase, all you have to do is press on this middle button at the bottom with the two arrows and then say send. So from there, you can go ahead and enter in the amount and make sure you're switching from Ethereum to uh, whatever coin it you wanna send. So I'm switching it over to EOS and I can send $100 worth of EOS. I can say continue and I just say not now. And now it's gonna ask you for two different addresses here which you can see right here. So they're asking you from the address at the top, and this is gonna be your EOS address that you wanna put in right up here. And then there's gonna be your memo address, which you just have to type in down here. Make sure before you send everything, it all matches up. And if you just wanna enter in everything manually, you're gonna to wanna to put this in the to address right at the top of your phone here. And then this right here is what you're gonna type into the memo address at the bottom. So I'm just gonna do an example here. I can type this in now, I'm at the memo. So 107954454 and I'll just say preview. And then it's gonna show me I can just press send now and that's gonna send from Coinbase on into Binance right here. And that's all you really have to do. And you'll see the total is $9.92. That's just because the amount of this money is so volatile, it's gonna change very rapidly. So after you've done that, you're gonna to want to come right over into your account here and you can actually press on wallet and then come down to press fiat and spot. This is where you make your deposits and withdrawals. And then after about a minute from when you sent it from Coinbase on into Binance, 
you're gonna see right here that your balance has grown a little bit. So your EOS will be right there. And then what you wanna do from here is actually trade this into the stable coin, which is Tether, so that your value is not fluctuating up and down so much. And then you have a liquid amount of money right here that you can then fund into any of your other coins. So I'm, I would come over to EOS and I would say trade. And then there's already some good options here. EOS to Bitcoin, EOS to USDT. That's what I would recommend for you guys. EOS to USDT. Press on that right down there. And now here's the trading platform where we can switch our EOS into USDT. So we're not gonna be buying EOS, we're actually gonna be selling it right here. Sure. You're gonna wanna make sure you're either on a market or a limit order. I think I just like to do limit orders. If you're on a market order, it's just gonna take it right as whatever price it was at at that moment. If it's a limit, you can actually set the price that you want it to sell at before it switches it into USDT. So over in the sell EOS tab, uh, you can actually drag this little slider here and it's gonna take all your percentage of your EOS. I literally hardly have any EOS anymore because I got rid of all of it, but I could press full amount here and I would then sell all my EOS and it would transfer it into USDT right then and there. And once that trade is successful, you can then come back into your wallet, come to fiat and spot again. And then pretty much immediately, you should be able to see that all your EOS was switched into Tether and your entire amount here is sitting at the top, which should be your tether. From there, you are able to come in and press trade at any point, and you can then go trade any of your tether to whatever token or whatever you want. You can even come here and just search in this search bar. So I can say Tron, and then I can say right here, I can start trading right from here and just say USDT to TRX. And then here we are at the trading platform where I can go and scroll the little slider and start buying a bunch of Tron with my USDT. And then I can go ahead and press buy and start making some massive gains from there. So that's a wrap with this video. Please drop a thumbs up, share this with everyone that wants to start making some money with cryptocurrency. I just set up a new crypto group, which I'd be more than happy if you guys check that out. That's also gonna be linked down below in the description. And let me know in the comments what kind of tokens and coins you think are gonna be blown up here in 2021. This is a massive bull run. And the best thing that I wanna give you guys in terms of advice when you start making this kind of money is have little goals and where you wanna start pulling out and taking profits because money can be up and it can be down and you wanna be capturing your profits at the end of the day. So that's all I wanna let you know about in this video. Thanks again so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Peace.